Hi guys, welcome back to Every Day with me, Nick. We're in the sawmill shed again. Day started off very, very poor. Raining, very, very, very hard raining. <laughs> uh, a lot of little flashy floods around, so yeah, that wasn't a good start. Um, but today, yeah, we're in sawmill shed, and um, I got con. I bet this wind's driving. Yeah, we go. Right, I got contacted this morning by a guy. Morning. Um, I've, I went to school with him and whatnot, and I know what he does for work. And um, just messaged me out the blow, can you cut oak or ash on the sawmill? And I was like, yeah, depends what size. Obviously, it's only a Frontier OS 27, so it can. It says it could do 27 diameter, but it's nowhere near them them figures. So I said, yeah, what are you after? He says, oh, we need some uh, we need some boards, some ash boards, oak boards uh, for crab pots. I'll leave a picture here. And uh, basically what he wants is a uh, load of them boards milling down. Now he did say that there was a sawmill that they used to use, but it's closed down or closing down. So I was like, yeah, I'll try and uh, I'll, I'll make some it up, see what we can do. I actually have ash logs on the deck, fortunately. And uh, basically what I've got here is, uh, I've got an ash log on the mill. There she right. Uh, she's got a little bit of a slope. She's not. Uh, she's not the best, but it's not bad either. So what he wants is like three foot long, three inch wide, three quarters of an inch thick. So if you're in new money like me, nine twenty long, twenty mil thick, seventy five mil width. So basically, what I think I'm going to try and do here is get this down to some sort of cantable size see where we're at if I can get nine inch out of it that'd be nice and I'll just basically slab it up into three inch thick or 75 mil thick uh, pieces and just lay them on the mill and then just take the 20 mil cuts down so that's what I'm going to try and do and that's what you're going to see me do <laughs> so yeah it'd be nice if i could get this because it looks like it's going to be an ongoing contract so you know it's good for the business um so that's what we're doing uh how is everybody else doing are we all good what's uh what's new in your life what's uh what's happening on your sawmill your projects your wherever you are what's happening leave it down in the comments and let me uh get you back like you know let's let's talk about it I've got a few exciting things coming up as well in the uh, future. You'll see it was meant to be already done by now, but you know how things are, they'll take the time. But yeah, we've got some some uh, some good things coming up soon. So yeah, without me blabbering on any longer, let's get this mill fired up. Let's get it cut in. Let's get this swoop out of it because it is it is a little bit... Uh, I don't know if it can tell it on... But it has got a, a swoop up here, so we're gonna we're gonna take that off first and try and get it canted down. Who knows? You just don't know when you're working with wood. I've just had to repair my tripod for the 50th time. No, make that the 500th time. It's now got gaffer tape all over it. <laughs> but you know what? She still stands, and I don't know how. So there we go. Now we're just gonna get used up. And then uh, let's get to work. Right. Flick. No. Now flick. No, I was I was hoping that that magic. Have you seen that magic where they do that flick and it's all done? No. Doesn't work on me. Ooh. Still not working. Right. Let's just get on with it.
I think I'm going to do this a way that I don't normally do it and I think I'm going to flip it 180 degrees. Normally I don't do that. Normally I, uh, I flip it 90. I, actually, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what it looks like. We've there been so much of a swoop to this thing. And uh, I'm a bit unsure how this is going to go. I really need to put some rollers on these stops because these dogs. a little bit. So we'll do that now. I think I'm going to make myself one of those. Right, have you ever had a log that you wanted to put on your mill and in your head you know what size you want? So in my head I had 920 mil at, at least. Right, so log measures 1010 mil, which is just like three and a half foot. Three foot four. So I cut it at that. That's where I want boards. Not too much waste when it comes to it. I didn't have much left hot log anyway. So I was like, yep, yeah, right. Then it comes to putting it on the mill. And you're like, ah, oh, you idiot. There need to be 1200 minimum, four foot, to get between the bunks and the stops and the back stops. So what do you do? You do this, you put a thick board underneath so it bridges it, job done, 
and then you put another board behind it as it acts as a backstop it's only a thin board but it does it's doing the job so now we are all set up ready to go so let's get milling Right folks, we are done for today, uh, as usual, night shift, um, we've got a few done but some of this ash has been, he's, he's rotten, he's not going to take that so yeah I'll show you what I mean, it has been raining a little bit so it's going to show it a little bit more, what can you see, the colours in that, it should be, it should be white almost white but no it's got it's got some rot in it so i don't know if that's going to be any good this stuff that i've just milled that's all perfect that stuff that's all good just needs the ends trimming up uh got got another one over there I've, actually i have got a few more ash logs on the on the deck so um i said to him i will i'll just go through them and just just mill up and see what you see you know see if it's decent so he's going to take he's going to bring his boss he's going to bring his boss next time he comes uh the, so and see what he thinks uh i'll put some i'll put these brown boards to a side where they're brown and if he can use them he can if he can't well it is where it is so i'm done <laughs> I've done. I don't even know how many I've done. I've done a few. There's there's about uh, if you look at the end stack here, look. You know, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, eighty-three. Most some some of them are all doubled. So yeah, it will be hundred and. 30 I would have said he wants 350 <laughs> yeah so we'll be back to this next time we're off I've got a bit of work on the next couple of days so I can't I'm not milling so yeah here's where it is
we just just have to do it when we can he, he knows that as well i did tell him so yeah thanks very much for watching guys and as ever leave a comment if you want to know anything if you just want to say hi how you doing we're back uh i'm just going to go put the tractor away now put my gear away put me put my chainsaw away and uh whoop, whoop, whoop. i'm going to drop the camera there and i'm going to uh, go get a shower before work so yeah see y'all on the next one guys <laughs>